Shalom, shalom. I am from AMA, Germany, and I'm here to invite you to the event Big God, Big Things in September in London, UK. Wow, we will see the power of God, and I invite you. I am from Germany, and I definitely will be there. Please don't miss on this great opportunity. Be part of it. If you need healing in your body, in your soul, in your spirit, come. If you want to see the power of God unlike anything before, come. I invite you. You will not regret it. This is your opportunity, your chance. Each and every time I have been to AMI and to any of the events, my life was changed. And I really wish and pray this for you too. Either it's your first time or you have been there before, this is for you. Don't let this chance pass you by. And we'll gladly meet each other there. Know that God loves you and that this is the call of God for you. London, UK, this September 2023. God is amazing and God will do it again. May God bless you. Shalom everybody! Spain is going to United Kingdom to experience Big God who does big things like it was two years ago in Paris. Come and see what the Lord is about to do into our lives. See, see you, you there. there! Hello everyone! My name is Brigitte. I am going to the UK, London, to the event Big God Big Things. I am from Latvia. Latvia is one of the three Baltic states. Join, come, meet the great God.
to your family that God may bring restoration to your to your finances to your marriage whatever you are trusting God for the floodgates of heaven are open meaning God is attentive to your cry for the Lord's the Lord is attentive to the cry of the righteous righteous child of God yes you are the one God is uh, calling and God is speaking to you right now worship him praise his name Glorify Him, for He alone is God. Besides Him, there is no other God. Let the fragrance of the Holy Spirit, the living God, be upon you today as you pray with us tonight in this beautiful time and moment of let's pray. May the Lord God open every door that is locked in your life. May the Lord God bless you today. May God bless your family. May God bless everything dear to you today. We worship you to God. We worship you, Baba. Baba, oh, today, Lord, we lift up our hands and we say, Jehovah, Jehovah, Father of heaven and earth. Hallelujah. 
you Jesus there is a fragrance right now you know when you take perfume and you put perfume all over yourself you can literally smell what you're putting on yourself so the same is happening right here right now the fragrance of the Holy Spirit the presence of God is in this place and the presence of God is in your home right now all you need to do is believe and connect all you need to do is just have faith in this God he is a good God he is a marvelous God he's the God of the altar of AMI he is a covenant keeping God he will never fail you he is too faithful for that he is true to your to his word the bible says even if we are unfaithful god remains faithful he does not change because of circumstances he does not change because of situations he does nothing nothing changes god the bible says he is the same yesterday today and he will forevermore be the same to him be the glory now and forevermore beloved i know for sure sure one thing for sure is that tomorrow I might not be here but the Bible guarantees you something that God Almighty will be with you every single day where you go he will be there where he where you go he will be there if you are in a hospital bed he is right there with you he is not far away he is not like anybody that needs a passport or a visa to be close to you he is forever God and that what makes the difference between God and man is that God may never leave you nor forsake you he will be with you every day till the end of times he will be with you in the fire in the waters in the valley in the mountains God is God God Almighty is always there he is God he is God he is God he is above all circumstances he is the great I am he is Yahweh he is Jehovah he is the God that my cup my father lives on day and night he is the God of our Lukau he is the God that shows us signs and wonders he is the mighty God he is God he is almighty he is almighty he is powerful you do not need anybody and any other guarantee the doctor might come to you and tell you something else but I'm here to say he is God he is seated on the throne he has got all power in his hand no matter what you are going through remember he is God he is God he is God he has power he has power he is our mighty God oh his fragrance is evident today his fragrance is evident today the aroma of his presence heaven is open angels are ascending and descending right now as we are fellow workers with God and we are here to say there is none like him hence we will forever worship God he is almighty oh Jesus thank you for the access of having to worship God thank you Jesus thank you for giving us access to the Father we come into his presence just like the angels and we say Abba Father what a covenant we thank you Lord thank you Jesus beloved we are anxious to pray today we are not anxious for anything else but to pray because our spirits are bubbling for prayer hallelujah I want to welcome those that are tuning in for the very first time if you are here and you are tuning in to let's pray you are more than welcome you couldn't have done a better choice than the choice of tuning in to let's pray tonight hallelujah the presence of God is so beautiful the presence of God is so awesome in this place for those that are continuously praying with us on let's pray God bless you the Almighty God that we serve bless you I know that uh, those that are watching us on YouTube those that are on Facebook Instagram Twitter and all the social platforms of Alleluia Ministries I know that your life will never be the same again 
and I, I do not gamble saying this, I'm just saying that the presence is just ordinary today. It's that supernatural presence of God in this place today. And I just want to thank God. God bless you as you tune in. I want you to invite your families, your friends, make time so that we can pray together. It's a few minutes and it's a few minutes in the presence of the Almighty God. For He is God. Hallelujah. He is God. You know the devil tried to raise himself above God, but he can never even get to a tiny bit of what God is. Not even a bit. Hallelujah. In fact, not even in our level can he get how much more the level of the Almighty God. So we will worship him forevermore. So for those that are tuning in from uh, YouTube, let's, uh, we just want to welcome you on behalf of Apostle Alf Lukau. We just want to say welcome to Let's Pray. Hallelujah. This is a beautiful program. That has been uh, started with our men of God. One of the greatest gifts he has given me is to teach me how to pray. How to remain in the presence of God. How to, to, in, uh, to, to, to stay in the presence of God. Beloved, prayer is not easy. You need to crucify the flesh to be able to say, I'm going to pray. And very early, early, early in my marriage, I did not know how to. In fact, I did not even know how to pray loud. I was thinking that something is seriously wrong with people that pray loud. I was those peop uh, one of those people that would pray very deeply in my heart. But today I'm here to say that God is, is a good God. The journey is long. But one thing for sure is that uh, God Almighty has has just been faithful in my life through prayer and i thank god for the men of god that have taught me how to remain in the presence of god thank you you are my coach you are the one i love hallelujah the one that stands with me and uh, i thank god for you men of god i just want to honor your anointing i want to thank god for everything that you are doing for the kingdom of God. Sometimes it's very difficult. We take it for granted. But I want to know, let you know that every sacrifice, every prayer, every intercession is appreciated by those that genuinely love you. Hallelujah. And those that genuinely are thankful to God for you. We ask only one thing of the Lord for you. That God continues to strengthen you. That God continues to give you uh, uh, strength that God continues to pour his anointing his love that you continue to run this race it's not an easy race it is a race that only God can be able to give you uh, make you help you to feed the people of God may you live long that every generation may even know about you the generation to come and the other to come and many may uh, speak about your faithfulness to God I thank God for you. I thank God for the bishops of Alleluia Ministries. I thank God for those that are serving alongside our men of God. And I also thank God for those that are here right on Zoom. God bless you. God bless you. I know that uh, we are so much together. Hallelujah. Those that are worth it, we are in different time zones. But in faithfulness, you are coming here to come and intercede and to pray with us. Today, God is God in your life. Hallelujah. God is God. And He alone is a mighty warrior. He will remember your sacrifice and He will remember you as you pray dearly with your Father in Let's Pray. My altar, my life. Hallelujah. My altar, my life. Today, we just want to lift the name of Jesus. I want you to just uh, close your eyes and I want you to declare the words of God over your life. Today, Lord, we thank you. We give you glory. We give you honor. We say, oh God, there is none like you. From everlasting to everlasting, Lord, you alone are God. I want us to pray today. I'm not going to give you any word because I want us to remain in the presence of God. I want you to just lift up your voice and I want you to pray and ask God for anything because heaven is open. Today, oh God, may the mighty God that we serve bless you. May God God Almighty be glorified. In faith today, O oh God, we stand against every work of the enemy, against every plan of Satan in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Rabba Shekere Bahalabandere Lebo Shekere. Rabba, let's pray, let's pray. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus.
your name, Jesus.
in whichever language, but just speak to him and tell him how much he means to you. He brought us this far not to leave us. He will not give up on you. your holy name we worship you oh God beloved I want you in faith to continue reaching out to God the Bible says that Abraham was a man of great faith he took his family God spoke to him and said take your family to a land I will show you it was a step of faith he did not know where he was going but out of faith and trust to, uh, to God, he obeyed God. Sometimes all he does is to trust and obey him. All he does is to believe that he will come through for you on the other side. I believe that God will do a mighty thing in this season. I believe that God will do a wonderful thing in this season. I am trusting God for big things. For a prophetic word has been declared over our lives. Big God, big things. Big God, big things, not small things, but big God, big things. We have entered into a new season. We have entered into a new era. We have entered into a prophetic moment. We are trusting God for big things. No longer, oh God, we will pray for small things. We will pray for big things, oh Lord, for you are a big God. Hallelujah. You are the Alpha, the Omega. You are the beginning, the end. Oh God, you are the bright morning star. You are Jesus, the one who is able to do, oh God, into our lives that, that nobody can do. Big God, big things. Big God, big miracles. Big God, big healing. Big God, big finances. Big God, big God, big things. We are, oh God, in a different season, a different zone, a different time. child of God be encouraged today that you are entering into a new prophetic season hallelujah through our men of God God spoke to us big God big things God is awesome he's wonderful he is almighty he is what you and I cannot explain in words Alpha and Omega just thank him for the prayers that you have doing and everything that he has done we just want to say thank you, oh God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you for let's pray. Thank you for our spiritual father. Thank you, Lord, for showing us the way to go every single day. I just want to say that our time is, has come to an end. But the time of God is always on. Hallelujah. God bless you. God bless your family. On behalf of Apostle Alf Lukau, we want to thank you for tuning in into Let's Pray. We just want to say shalom and we love you. Shalom, shalom. I am from AMA, Germany, and I'm here to invite you to the event Big God, Big Things in September in London, UK. Wow. We will see the power of God, and I invite you. I am from Germany, and I definitely will be there. Please don't miss on this great opportunity. Be part of it. If you need healing in your body, in your soul, in your spirit, come. If you want to see the power of God unlike anything before, come. I invite you. You will not regret it. This is your opportunity, your chance. 
each and every time I have been to AMI and to any of the events, my life was changed. And I really wish and pray this for you too. Either it's your first time or you have been there before, this is for you. Don't let this chance pass you by. And we'll gladly meet each other there. You know that God loves you and that this is the call of God for you. London, UK, this September 2023. God is amazing and God will do it again. May God bless you. Shalom everybody. Spain is going to United Kingdom to experience big God who does big things like it was two years ago in Paris. Come and see what the Lord is about to do into our lives. See you there. Hello everyone. My name is Brigitte. I am going to the UK, London, to the event We Got Big Things. I am from Latvia. Latvia is one of the three Baltic states. Join, come, meet the great God. Thank you for tuning into our broadcast. We trust that you've been blessed. For more information and resources, visit our website at www.alleluiaministries.com. For our prayer line, you may call the numbers on your screen. Tune in to our next broadcast. Stay blessed.